Hi, I'm Dale Snyder. I'm the curator here at Zoo America North American Wildlife Park. Today I'm standing in front of our green tree frog exhibit. Uh, amphibians are an uh, animal that is being worked on extensively in zoos. They're worried about a worldwide extinction, many diseases that are causing problems for these creatures. As we have global warming affecting parts of the earth, it seems like the temperatures in many areas are getting warmer, and that's bad news for some of the amphibians. It allows some funguses and different things to attack them of a little more frequency. So zoos are working across the world to try to protect a lot of the amphibian species. This is a very common species, the, the green tree frog that we have here at the zoo. And they're found from Maryland south all the way through the uh, southern tip of Florida and through much of the southern swamp area where we have them here in, in our building. They're also found all along the Illinois Valley, the valley along the Mississippi River, so there are a widespread tree frog species. This is an animal that eats almost entirely insects. Uh, they'll prey upon moths and all kinds of insects, whatever they can find to survive. And one of the neat adaptations that I think is pretty cool about them, they have very sticky little substances on the pads of their feet, which allow them to climb up and down trees, and here in our exhibit, climb up and down the glass. So it looks like they're hanging almost with those little adhesive pads. Tiniest animal that we exhibit here in our southern swamp building, but the loudest. The males in particular can have a throat pouch that they can swell and use to resonate and make all kinds of loud noises that attract other frogs. In our particular area of the country, you can hear a lot of the frogs singing in the springtime. This is a particularly loud one that you find a little bit further south. A group of tree frogs is called a chorus because of the loud noises that they make. And when a whole group of them are singing together, it's said to sound a lot like cowbells ringing. Mm -hmm.